Good day guys. So a few days ago I made a video about a shop tour and I asked you guys some for advice about it cha changing my YouTube name. So presently it's called French River Springs. And uh, thank you so much uh, for your advice. A lot of you uh, suggested that I use the name French River Woodworks because this is the name of my business, French River Woodworks. So I might use that. Um, I also thought about even using just my name, Gilbert Roy. That would be my YouTube channel name. Um, there's also uh, my sister uh, suggested the, uh, the Northern Carpenter. So I kind of like all three, so I'm kind of undecided right now. Um, French River Wood Woodworks would be similar to French River Springs, so, but if friends wants to share my channel and, and they want to talk about me, French River Woodworks might be harder to remember than the Northern Carpenter. So I thought maybe the Northern Carpenter is a bit more catchy. So <laughs> I need more advice. So do I, do I choose French River Woodworks or the Northern Carpenter or Gilbert Roy? So if you guys uh, can give me that advice. And now I'd like to show you an exciting tool that I bought two months ago and I really like it. So let me show you what I bought. All right, so this is what I got here is the knot filler kit. All right, so uh, this is what it comes with. It comes with the glue gun. It comes with glue sticks. You can get the color of your choice. There's many, many different colors you, you can get. Like there's oak color, cherry, walnut. There's all kinds of colors. You can get those glue sticks. And those are not the uh, normal glue sticks. They're much harder and, um, and they're actually sandable. And um, this here is the aluminum plate. I will show you in a minute how it works. And then you also have, it's like a, a flush plane, a flush trim. Anyways, you'll see in a minute uh, how it works. So um, in the uh, description, I will provide uh, a link or, or more than one link, one link if I can, where you can buy this knot filler kit. Um, but be careful. Um, I think most places uh, the price is similar, but when it comes to, to buying these glue sticks here, um, some places might really gouge you uh, because there's not much competition so far. So uh, you might want to shop around where you can get the best price on those glue sticks. All right, I'll remove the protective cover. So uh, this is to trim the excess uh, glue here. So let's let's try. We're gonna fill these two little holes right here. Let's do little warm holes. Okay, then we put the aluminum plate like so and press it hard. So that's gonna squeeze the glue deep in the holes. And uh, at the same time, um, you know, the cold aluminum plate will uh, will um, cool down the, the glue really, really fast. So you only have to, you know, hold this plate here for like 20 seconds. And then you just take this here and just cut the excess glue off. And that's it, those holes are filled up. They're very, very light sanding and it's, it's done. See, that's how quick it is. Here, I'll give you more of a close up here. Okay, so we'll do a more uh, reasonable size hole there. So there, you have an idea how long it is. Uh, yeah, there's a crack right here. It's at least an eighth of an inch deep.
look at that guys. That's absolutely incredible. How long did this take? 30 seconds? Can you imagine like pouring epoxy and waiting overnight for the epoxy to cure? And then it's hard to sand. At least this year you can cut it with that. And then this is just 220 grit. You sand for a few seconds and that's it. This is done. And then you can pour epoxy over it or you can spray a lacquer or varnish. Whatever your favorite finish is, put your favorite finish right over that and it's done. Absolutely incredible. All right, let's do a very, very narrow crack there. You can see by my finger how small this crack is. So just to show you, you know, it still works with very small crack. One, two, three, four, five, six. Should be good enough. Look at that. Look at that. This is how fast this is. This is perfect. Just a very light sanding and it's done. Just like that. Alright, so this is a knot that I filled earlier, so let's see what happens when I put a little bit of Odie's oil on it. Now I'm going to buff it off. There, look at that. Perfect. All right guys, so there wasn't much to this video, but um, I think this could be uh, really handy if, you, if you've never heard about a knot filler kit before. Um, it's certainly much faster than using uh, glue with sawdust or, or epoxy. Um, this is the fastest way of filling knots that I've ever seen and I uh, use it all the time now. So again, um, I'll put some links in the description where you can buy it. And uh, also don't forget uh, French River Woodworks or the Northern Carpenter or Gilbert Roy. All right, guys. Thanks for watching.